Hi everybody, welcome back to Major Renaissance, episode 22, with me Sid, and uh, I'm just out and about, um, gathering this stuff, because it turns out I was missing a trick. Now, I'm going to apologise straight away, because I haven't got your name to hand, but you know who you are. Uh, <laughs> well, you, are, you do if you're watching this and you remember saying it, but apparently these things preserve curiosities are very much like or one of the as it appears to be a number of curiosities um, but this is the one we can easily get right now they're very much like knowledge fragments used to be in um, in old Thorncraft in that they well they give you knowledge like you know like a knowledge fragment kind of really now, the other thing is, because I live in the mountainous biome, these things are bloody everywhere. So, it really doesn't take a lot of effort to to run around and extract these surface ones. Um, from the, I suppose, for want of a better word, the surface. Now, I, mean, I haven't not getting huge rates from this. Let me just uh, quickly sleep before it gets dark. But... Um, yeah, it's, uh, I mean, I've, out of two and a bit, two and a half stacks, give or take, I've got five. So, well, six actually, because I've used one. Um, so, yeah, I mean, it's, oh, yeah, there's another. Oh, hello, two. When's Thanksgiving? Um, I'm English, we don't celebrate Thanksgiving, so, you know. Um, oh, there's another one, there you go. Yeah. But we definitely, uh, if I were those turkeys, I would be worried right now. Because uh, I'm sure it's around the corner. Maybe. I know it's, it's, it's coming up towards Christmas. It's not that far away, is it? I know it's around about Christmas, before Christmas, something like that. Yeah. Strange foreign cult, cult customs. We're, we're not up on them. Uh, <laughs> hard, hard to think of, you know, that's a foreign custom. Anyway, yeah, so... I think I think I'm getting a bit kind of had enough for doing this now. I'll just um I'll grab anything on the way back that I see, but I think I'm gonna go out of my way now. There's where one they see. Just in case. The other thing is this is actually a good source of um, a couple of essentials anyway, so uh, and they're used in other things. And strangely enough, they're also classed as being amber from things. Now they're not particularly high tier. But if you wanted to make a tool, an amber tool, you could do. There's nothing to stop you. Uh, okay, any... Let's just head over. Yeah. I've got more than enough bits of dead villagers cluttering up my base at the moment. That sounds wrong. Um, but you know what I mean. Uh, you do any more for any more. Any more over... Whoa, don't go flying off the edge of... That's a bit of a uh, essential down there. Um, yeah. Now, what you can do with these, well, the reason I'm doing this is because you, apart from there is no use for them, apart from you get Cognito and Bestia from them. That was a oh, bit of uh, alchemy, al two up points. Some more. And another one. And another one. And of course, all of that is going to come in handy um, when we come to doing research, because it means we don't have to do the little mini-game. So, thanks for pointing that one out. I probably would not have clicked onto that. Come. Boom. You didn't jump off, you swine. I was hoping to scare it and make it go thud. Anyway, I am going to just head back home. Um, where I will show you what I've been up to and we'll get a little bit more done uh, if I can just get oh man this thing steals steers like a thing I haven't taken the uh, dimension doors out yet we ow there we go uh, right and insert I actually went out to grab these <laughs> berry bushes um, but I've got a few bits and pieces and we first things first we need to 
Hmm, let's think. We need to start off with a little bit of silent gems. Mm-hmm. Or do we? Do we? Do we really? Do we? I don't think we do. Uh, but we do need to get rid of you if we can. And we do need to get rid of you. And we need to drop off those and those and those and that. Uh, and that's food, so that can go into there. Got those, I want that. Possibly, oh, and that, that can just go in, in there temporarily. And that can go in there. Excellent, those are things we wanted, and we've got the uh, stuff. So, let me show you what we've been up to. So in terms of the, the oh, bones, ah, bone meal. Bone meal, uh, maybe a book, maybe my buckets as well, actually. Uh, let me just take a small selection of bones and uh, turn those into a larger selection of bone meal. And let's go and grab a couple of buckets of water. Because we're going to want that. Uh, I also want uh, some sand, I think. And a bit of coarse dirt wouldn't go amiss as well. Uh, yeah. And then we should be in a position to actually start doing a little bit of something. So we did this. We built this last thing. Uh, I brought the path out. I can't remember whether I did that last episode or not. And we've got the little lanterns here and there. I haven't lit this up yet, and it's not obviously lit up on the outside either. However, we have got a few toys to play with now. We've got these. These are... Oh, that's not, not what I wanted. Let me try... These are... I don't know what they're called, actually. Men done. Uh, I have no idea what they are. They're apparently something... Showing my ignorance. But a bit of decorative stuff going on there. Uh, and then we've got this. This is um, this is a Chinese fence, which looks very nice when it's a fence, but I was wanting to use it as something else. I was wanting to use it as a... No. I'm going to go... Oh, bomb. Don't do that. Are you not going to go on that? Oh, you do. Looks like The model looks a little bit strange, but... We can't certainly can't complain at the effectiveness of it. So let us try a few of these. And what I'm thinking is just for unconcealed lighting, because whilst I'm a big fan of concealed lighting, I'm also a big fan of unconcealed lighting. Um, because it it just adds that. I mean, we can we can hide as much light in the ground as we like, um, but it's never going to quite have the. And just pop another one there, maybe, and maybe just one there, uh, and perhaps one over here. Now, what I was wanting to do is make a little. I'm going to leave the tree in there. Uh, I'm not going to take that out, but I want to make a little pond down here. And then we're going to have a little river leading down into the pond stream. Because one thing I have noticed with most of the Japanese gardens uh, I've been to, which are not many, I'll be honest, and certainly not in Japan. Um, so their authenticity is possibly a little bit suspect at times. But they tend to, oh, let me just get that back off as well. They tend to have quite a, a lot in the way of water features. Now, I'm going to use some of this coarse dirt, uh, like a sou. And what I want to do is from here, just take this. Kind of down like that, maybe a little bit wider. We'll just 
just mix a bit of this in a bit more coarse maybe maybe even just a little bit in places around the the bank as well and definitely taking out any any grass and then obviously we can just get in here and go mad with the water and just get that up to speed so I'm going to get this done. I'll continue lighting the area up a little bit more cleanly and uh, I'll be back with you in a moment. All right, well, that, as best as I can tell, is fully lit. Uh, I've used a mixture of hidden lighting, um, so you can see obviously it's not lit outside, but inside we've got the lighting down. We are about as secure in here as we can be um, I'm just going to F2 get him a little self screenshot not sure whether that's the one I'll use but you know got to get the screenshot before you can use it and I do want to just pop a few of these down I've also got a little bit of I keep picking picking things up as you do uh, when you're going around doing this stuff things pop off um, so we'll grab the, I put a little bit of coarse dirt under a few of the trees, not all of them, just to give you that kind of dead, shadowed, you know, shadow stuff, that's the word, shadowed stuff. Uh, we'll stick one there, maybe one there, uh, maybe even one there. And I think that is probably it now obviously this is all decorative none of this is functional and this was supposed to be my botani botania area can i get you to give me a that's by the way i've illuminated up there as well i used the thing and got up there and made sure that none of those branches are spawnable so that's all safe there shouldn't be nothing coming in here whatsoever um yeah, so what's next? Uh, the answer is I don't know. I haven't decided yet. Uh, so I am going to go and uh, just do that and I shall be back with you in a moment. All right, we need to continue on with our um, magic and the area that I want to play with, I want to play with this more. Now, the Master Sorcery wand, we, we've basically upgraded this, I think, as far as we can take it the uses for that we uh mana flat oh yeah just recharging it um you do do so we definitely need to give you a charge there are some upgrades and various things we can do to it but right now i just want to pop a little bit of charge on that two three four what do we need uh, about 800 four one two three four five six seven eight so it occurs, appears that oops, it appears that we are missing an obvious trick. So I have currently got on this. Um, let's have a look. Magic missile, dart, arc, heal, uh, and heal, and an empty slot. So if we, if I can hold on shift, do we go that way? We can dart and. And that's fine. We can arc and doesn't do anything. I think you have to have a target for that probably. And I don't know whether we've got one. I'm not even sure whether it's a good idea to fire this at creepers either. But let's have a look, see what we can find out here. If anything. I love it when it tells me there's a target and then the target isn't actually there. Alright, um, Hello, dear. It's quite good. <laughs> yeah, that uh, did 
two hearts of damage. Not a huge amount. However, it apparently, apparently, we don't need to identify the books before we apply them. We can apply an unknown spell and then cast it. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to start off with... Um, I want to move all of this up into the tower as well. I'm going to start off with a nice, clean, empty um, wand. doesn't really matter. It can be... We'll go with a wand of shadows. And then we need all of our novice... I think it's our novice spells. Uh, novice, we've got magic missile. Novice, we don't know what that is. Or that... Uh, da -da, or that, or that, or that, or that. Now, some of these are probably duplicates because that and that are duplicate. And that, so they can go back in. So I say those were independently separate. That I think we've seen before. We looks like we have. I've been just looking at the galactic character set and seeing if we can't see what is what, if anything, in there. Novice, 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 thunderbolt, novice. All right. So we've got four spells. That's got this wand will have a number of slots. So we should be able to. Not that one stupid we should be able to take that and apply these do I really want to nah. see some of these I don't have duplicates of do I <laughs> if I apply them let's just oh yeah no that's fine we don't lose the book so let's do those take that out and let's go somewhere safe and see what these do and that should right it's uh, not a block spell and it's not pointing at anything you want spell so now we need to go and kill you know in hindsight killing all those deers around the area wasn't such a good idea hmm because now I need targets and I don't have a lot. Oh, mine trick. Oh. I don't know what that does. Uh, but we, we know it's mine trick now. So what we should be able to do is have a look at that. Uh, Confusers for sit, render it unable to attack effectively. Okay, so it's basically it's a confusion spell. Okay, right, 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 right. So we can go over to here to the next one and nope, not nope. Still don't know what that is. Hmm. That one is proving awkward. Must leap, okay. And that smoke bomb. Oh, okay. Poof. You can't see me now, confused deer. Right, well, we are a little bit of the wiser. There's one of these, we don't know what it is, and we'll probably need to buy an identify spell for that. But let's go and have a look at the, the next tier of spell. I may bring that altar out with me, actually, <laughs> just because um, going in and out is a bit of a bind. But if we look in here, these should all be novice spells, and that should add smoke bomb, leap, and mind trick. So this one here, we don't know what it is. And I think that's all of our novice spells. So after a novice, we probably into a apprentice spells at a guess. Would seem to be where we should be. Apprentice. Let me just sort out some more spells to test, and I'll be back in a moment. Alright, we're using our good spell, spell, and 
I think if I go and take this, that would... Oh, damn it, I didn't really want... Well, we might as well. We might as well apply all five and see what they do. Because um, we can always decide which spells we want later. Uh, okay. Doesn't... Uh, oh! Fire Sigil. What does that do? I don't know what that does. Which is Fire Sigil? Fire Sigil. Place a magical fire trap on the ground which damages and sets on fire a target creature that triggers it. Oh, okay. So it's a trap. Cool. Let's go to the next one. Not a... That's a targeted, I'm guessing, then, because it's not working for anything else. No. Don't know what that one does. That's a... Uh, pocket fern. Oh. You just cooked things in my inventory. Oh, wow. That's actually an interesting one. Okay. Oh, wither. Maybe we can't wither deers. I would have thought you could wither a deer. Alright, uh, and banish. Alright, well that gives us all of them bar one again, which we've disco discovered. That is interesting. I'm not sure how some of these could be used, but so we've got the fire sigil, pocket furnace is smelts to five smeltable items in the inventory, items on the hot bar smelted first, okay. Uh, banish is teleports to target against its will to a random location within a certain range. Hang on. Hang on. Why? Right. Oh, hello. <coughs> Didn't really move him that far, did it? Okay, well, that's fine. Still don't know about that one. And wither. Fires a ray of darkness with, with it, which withers anything it touches. I have no idea. But we have some more things. Right, so that's all of our apprentice levels. Let's go and grab some bigger ones, and I'll be back in a second. All right, got the last of the batch. So the advanced, the those two are masters. These are all advanced. So we shall do those four. Uh, huh. That appears to do. That's um, certainly not a block, and it's certainly not a. Wow, that is interesting. Can I find a few clustered together? I think I know what that does, but... Um... It does a fair amount of damage. I like that spell. <laughs> Alright, let's... Um... Okay. Hup, where are you? Don't know what that does again. These, this, some of these spells. <laughs> Oh, I like it. What is he doing? He's just wandering badly off in a direction. Okay, that's interesting. <laughs> that is weird. Got a fair old cooldown on it. I 
Don't know how long they last either, but... Oi, come back here. <laughs> okay, well that's uh, the... I think that's all of the apprentice spell. The, master, the advanced spells. The last ones to play with are, of course, the master spells, which we'll apply. Hmm, we probably should eat before we do anything like that. On the basis that I've got no idea what this is going to do to me. Where did all my decoys go? Have they, have they, disp have they dispelled? They appear to have. Okay. So that one doesn't appear to be air. It might be that archery. Okay, so we don't know what that is. Oh, hello. Sorry. Come on, lads, let's go get them. Are they following me? No, they're not there. But that's an interesting one, anyway. Okay, and then we've got uh, the only other one. Ice Giant. Wow. 100 health. It's a shame there's nothing mad at me in the area okay well that's that's all of the the spells we can research now as i say we need to go and talk to some friendly wizards uh wizards even wizards i'm going to take that we're going to just reprogram our wand with a few things that we actually want i think now and uh and recharge it a little bit and then we're going to go and talk to some friendly wizards and see if we can't get um Thing. So what we got there? Uh, chain lightning seemed good. Decoy, yeah, that's one we don't know. Oops, hang on. That's the one we don't know. So what would we actually want? Pocket furnace, fire sigil, mind trick, leap, light, smoke bomb, thunderbolt, arc. The arc was interesting. Blizzard, I'm not so sure about. Ice Giant, I just want to see what that does. Heal, potentially. And I think Magic Missile, uh, but that's five. And we don't have that many slots, do we? We only have five slots. So what do we want? Magic Missile. Arc, maybe not. Chain Lightning. Decoy. Heal. Summon Ice Giant. Apply. Okay, can we... Oh, we can leave... Now, that needs to go up there. Uh, we'll take all of these out. And we'll put those away as well. Put my food away. Grab some crystals. And just give that a quick recharge. And yeah, that should do us. And uh, in terms of that, Probably Magic Missile is our go-to. There's just a little, little pop, pop, pop. Right, let's go and let's go see a man about some spells, shall we? Oh, hell! On. I bet the Ice Giant has gone, hasn't it? Yeah, probably. A little bit of me wants to go and experiment with this before we uh, before we sleep the night away. And then the other little bit of me goes, yeah, that's... Yeah, we don't need to actually... Okay. I can see you. It's basically, it's a reskinned re uh, ice go golem, isn't it? Yeah. It is. Right, let's quickly sleep. And get on with this. I don't think he's going to be able to do much against those drowned, so... Yeah. Come on, can you... No, you don't actually follow me, do you? You just... And he's gone. 
All right, well, we've got two friendly wizards over here, so let's go and see what they've got and what they want to trade. And, uh, well, let me just get over there, and I'll be back with you in a sec. All right, well, this guy here has got the spell book for crystals, so we could get rid of some of those spare spell books. That's, that's, a, that's a starter. An advanced spell for 10 and 10 diamonds. So I'll bring some diamonds. Uh, I'm just going to make a quick note of uh, we need, obviously, we need crystals. And diamonds. Identify spell with gold, so we can bring a bit of gold over. So we've, we've got plenty, and that's magic missile. We're not interested in magic missile. Um, let's go back down, and let's see what this guy's got. Oh, hang on, this could be a little bit more awkward. There we go. Come on, where are you, sir? Come here. You, sir, what have you got? Again, he's doing spell books. Uh, an apprentice spell, seven diamonds. So if I bring 17 diamonds, not bothered about a necromancy wand. Um, we're not bothered about that. So 17 diamonds. And so if I bring 32, uh, maybe 48 gold and a whole load of crystals. Apologize if I, my, I fade away a little bit there, but I'm just turning around to make notes on my pad um, I use the word pad is probably slightly over exaggerating the uh, the thing here but there we go it's a pad it's a pad of paper it's a sheet of paper actually a piece of sheet of scrap paper right I'm gonna go grab that I'll be back in a sec all right we've got a whole load of bits and pieces I didn't have 17 diamonds so I actually only have 15 so I brought 10 because that was the the better one of the two was the advanced spell. Well, potentially the better one. It's an, obviously it's an advanced spell. Um, so let's go and see the wizard, the wonderful. Okay, well, just get back in your step, your shop, will you, mate? Right, you've got a spell. Uh, so if I go there. We've got magical dealings. Do you go like a villager? You do. And now you have a heal spell, which I don't really want. But you do have that. So let's go and grab that spell. And then let's see what we get. Oh, to no. I don't want to hear yeah, you've done us something. A master wand. Well, I've got a master wand, so I don't need a master wand. But we can go and sell you. Uh, okay, maybe we need to do that back here. Thank you. Do do no? no. You're doing something. Uh, I did want to buy a scroll of identify. I wanted th three of those. One. Two and three. Just because we can. I think this stack don't the yes. Mm, you reset. Oh. Got that. Uh, master to uh, any advance to master. Yeah, we don't need that either. But we can always sell him um, a few more of those. See what happens. Do, do, do. Mind trick here. Yeah. Don't need it. Got that. Come on. We'll probably max him out. Let's go see his mate. And up, right. See his mate. Right, what have you got? Yeah, I can't afford it. Yeah, that, that, smoke bomb, no, leap, no. Right, let's try him again. 
Mm. See what we get out of him this time. Summon zombie. Pee, got that one. <laughs> it's testificate trading where the uh, they actually don't look quite so silly. Master wand, don't need it. See where we get. Yeah, there we go. He's reset again. Wand of the Storm Mage, forty-five percent light and light lightning potency. Taking all his crystals, that's the thing. Uh, another arcana tome. I mean, if nothing else, we're getting rid of this. Let's see. If I give you one more, you must be getting close to the end of, of capping out your uh, stuff now. Yeah, it seems I think that is it with him. Right, let's go and find another mage. Back in a moment. Come to this one. This one is actually an evil mage. I'm gonna just. I'm gonna sleep before we think. I'm. I'm in an iron whether we should go and take him or not because the last time we tried to take on one of these guys, he killed us pretty quickly. However, we're not a million miles away from home, so there is always that option. We're also now a much higher level monk, so. Our punch is pretty lethal. Um, hi. Well. Ow. Did you just hit me back with a dart spell, perhaps? <laughs> Alright. Where did you just go? <laughs> what is he... Not very long range that one, is it? <laughs> oh. No, oh, that's not good. <laughs> These guys are actually fairly tough. Can I? Ah, he's just fired me again. <laughs> Not fired me because that obviously that sounds more like a. What's the word I'm looking for? That sounds more like I'm. I'm only trying to cheese it from the outside as well, though, which I, I realise is a little bit dubious anyway. Uh, let's get. Ha! <laughs> gotcha. Oh, he blinded me. All that magical duelling, and it was actually far more efficient. Hello, what we got? A snare? Scroll of Thunderbolt, some stuff. Nothing really overly useful. I'm going to have that, though. Just because we can. And we are going to... You know what? I'm having him with that as well. And his books. Why not, eh? I fought for them. <laughs> right. Oh, and his um, air crystals as well. Right. Totally worth it. Where's my next wizard? Pro There's one down there. I think there may be one over th that one. There. That's my nearest. Those two. 
Yeah, I think that one down that way. Right. Let's go and see if we can find a nice wizard this time, shall we? Back in a moment. All right. This is another evil one. Um... I see you there. I just don't see an easy way of getting in to beat nine bells. Let's start out of here. Ow. Not that tough. <laughs> what did you have? Tome. Oh, hello. Upgrades. Uh, and some stuff. Let me just do this one. Put this away. I've been collecting more of these, by the way. <laughs> you know I was passing them uh, we'll put those away and they can go away actually and that can eh. give me we'll put that in that can go there grab his books yeah they're not that bad now we've kind of upgraded our capability these wizards but um, certainly gave me a good scene to last time so that was an upgrade and that was an upgrade that's an achievement upgrade we've got those we yeah all right and we've got that to get rid of well, right two wizards towers down where next <laughs> I'm enjoying this far too much I think that wizard tower over there, and then well, let's do that one over there, uh, which is that way. So I will sit out. I will see you again in a minute. All right, this is what they call in the trade a big one, um, but it's also, I believe, a friendly. Yeah, you can tell. Look, he's wearing white. What you got? Apprentice, you've got a heal spell, you've got a master. Okay, none of that is really much use to me, but we can do those. And let him. Uh... No, you're not gonna. Gonna do a little bit of a unlock for me there. An advance, but oh god, 23 gold. I haven't got any gold on me. Damn it. I don't think I have anyway. Hang on. Not enough. Ow. Ow, ow, ow. Ow, 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 ow. Oh god, he's. He's kicking this not out of me. Hang on. Bye. <laughs> Ouch. Right, so, important lesson learned there is that if you place a block in a wizard's tower, he will assume that it's his. <laughs> Who knew? Clearly I didn't. Anyway, I think that's enough trading with wizards today. I'm going to uh, take the magic carpet loosely I'm going to take the magic carpet back towards home um, which basically means I'm probably going to crash an awful lot because I really cannot seem to get this thing to fly come on I mean that is why why are you so crap ah Ah, uh, 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 uh. at least we're heading in the right direction, I think now. Kinda. Yeah, there we go. Ah, oh. oh well, you know what? It's better than no flight at all. Uh, that that much is 
true. Yeah, I'll see you when I get back. All right, we're back. We've got that. I've put that new spell onto the um, wand. Uh, let's go just outside. I don't want to do anything that's detrimental to my build. Let's see what it does. Ice Shroud. Okay. That sounds suspiciously. No, nope, that's not the one we thought it was. Where are you? Ice Shroud. Around the caster, causing anything that attacks them to be frozen. That's what he got me with. Okay. That wasn't a bad thing. I'm not sure whether it was worth 10 diamonds, but it wasn't bad. I think it's probably better to go around beating the snot out of uh, evil wizards than uh, the other way around. Right, let's get rid of those and that. We've got those, and we should have in here three books that we don't know. One, two, and three. So we can... Do I want to hang on? Hang on. Let's just make sure there's only one possible option. Freezing weapon. Boom. Replenish. Oh, that might not be a bad one. And this novice spell is telekinesis. Let's see what these do, shall we? Move an object or item to a right click on the block you are looking at. It can also be used to disarm players. Yeah, doesn't sound overly brilliant to me. Freezing weapon. Temporary imbues the first weapon on the caster's hotbar with the power of frost. Magic wears off after 45 seconds. Yeah, again. I'm not going to get excited. Replenish hunger. Six hunger points. Basically free food then. Well, this is actually not free food because it costs energy, doesn't it? But you know what I mean. It's technically kind of like free food. Uh, the ice shroud. I'm going to leave that on there, actually. I think I've... What did I have on there? Chain line in my decoy. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, right. Let me see how long I've been recording and waffling for, and I'll be back with you in a moment. Altogether too long. <laughs> Again. Yeah, one day, you know, I will learn how to do this. So I think next episode, what I want to do is I want to move my um, Electro Blobs wizardry stuff up into here. Or if I can build another thingy, my boy, up here onto the next floor, uh, which may be the better one. I want to continue building out here. I would like to do some work in here, get some stairs or something going on and, and get myself back up and continue building up there as well. Um, and maybe get into moving the Batania stuff across. But I am, I'm really happy with the way this looks. This has definitely got the feel that I was looking for. This kind of rugged garden feel. And obviously when the fairies are out, you've got fairies. And, uh, you know, at night you, you or whenever you can sit here and you can meditate. Meditate on your peaceful environment. Except for the fact that there's one of those sprites there. So, on that note, thank you very much for watching, guys. And until next time, bye for now.